Oh, man, that was rough. <laughs> she wanted to go for a hike in the woods. What's up, guys? Got the new tracks, this XRT 8S out here. Uh, pretty excited to give this thing a little maiden run. Not going to go too crazy yet because she is all stock. I just want to get a nice feel for the truck. Uh, Trax has done an awesome job on the design of this thing, in my opinion. It's something completely new from them. And I really love the uh, low-profile Truggy. That's that's kind of my style. I like to uh, hold down power and have nice handling. So we're going to get for a nice little maiden run. She is all stock, except the only thing that I did is I put in a Max 6 ESC in here. Uh, max punch. And I did go ahead and uh, recalibrate the throttle. Whenever you change out your ESC or a receiver or anything, you always want to recalibrate your throttle endpoints to make sure you get full throttle because that can kind of screw screw you up and your, your truck ends up underperforming. So I did all that and also went to the uh, speed gearing uh, that comes stock to 2346. So I'm mainly just going to be doing some street ripping, a couple launches, and just see how the truck handles. So I shouldn't have any major uh, heat issues. I'm uh, still running the stock tires. We'll see how those hold up. I'm not going to go over a whole lot of details on this truck. There's tons of unboxings and uh, detailed videos for that kind of stuff. I just want to give this baby a maiden run. and really excited to be uh, testing some M2C parts on this baby soon. That's the main reason for this truck, guys, is to test those parts for you. Get these things dialed in for the extreme bashing. As far as the batteries, I've got Z-Packs in here, uh, 7,000 milliamp, 100 Cs, a uh, 2.4S to make 8S power. I love the Z batteries. A lot of guys ask me what I run nowadays, and uh, pretty much all Zs, I run the Z6S packs and the 8-scale uh, trucks. They're just really good batteries, and they, and they hold up pretty good to uh, hard bashing. I do like the chassis design on this, having this flat belly right here that'll definitely help with some uh, with some chassis slaps and stuff. But for the extreme bashing, you know, definitely gonna need to uh, put a chassis brace on it. A you know, bash bar and M2C racing will uh, hopefully have that soon to uh, be testing along with some other goodies. Some of the stuff that fits the X-Max will already fit in here. Like if you guys wanna put in a big motor, the M2C motor mount will fit right up in there and stuff like that. So you guys be on the lookout for some awesome hop-ups coming soon from M2C Racing. We're gonna get for a quick little run out here and uh, try not to go too crazy and see what's up. All right guys, here goes nothing. First throttle pull. Still likes the wheelie. Pretty quick with the 2346. Have fairly nice air control. Yeah, she handles pretty good. All right, guys, we got the ramp out. We're gonna get for a maiden send. I'm a little bit nervous. <laughs> so here goes nothing. She made it. She's still driving. It's a good sign. Oh, that was a hard chassis slap. <laughs> oh, a little bit of a noser. Pretty impressed so far, guys. I'll tell you what, I cannot wait to get some M2C upgrades on this thing. An 1100 kV hobby wing motor, a big block, uh, along with some belted tires, and uh, really send this thing. Right now, we're just doing some uh, warm up jumps. All right, guys, quick damage report. So far, the chassis looks all right. Uh, the only thing I see broke so far 
No crashes yet, just hard landings out there. I did snap this wing mount. I guess the weight of this big wing is pushing down. And that's very thin plastic right there, not a whole lot of meat to hold that together. So I'm sure somebody will come up with a nice aftermarket upgrade for that. <laughs> Gotta say guys, this thing is night and day from the X-Max. Barely made that. Looks like my wing is getting ready to drop off. <laughs> That was the first ultimate durability test. She got thrown around like a rag doll. Looks like everything's uh, still together. I'm about to lose my wing though. That's gonna be the biggest weak point of this truck, it looks like. Uh, out of the gate is this wing snapping. I'm gonna have to put some zip ties to hold this thing up once I replace that part to give it some extra support. There she is. That was awesome. Oh, serious noser. <laughs> She wanted to go for a hike in the woods. Actually, I'm the one that's got to go for a hike. Got to get through all these briars. That sucks. All right, guys, that's going to be it for the maiden run on this truck. Again, I don't want to go too crazy until we start testing some M2C parts and I get big power in this baby. She's definitely capable. Uh, this truck handles really nice. It's a little bit squirrely on the road and stuff just due to the tires of course belted tires will help with that anytime you got that ballooning it wants, wants to make it a little bit squirrely but again we'll get this thing dialed in but out of the box it's definitely pretty fun uh with the 2346 gearing i'll definitely watch your attempts i had to let, I give it some cool downs and stuff you know i wasn't running constant with that gearing so it will definitely overheat the system again the uh, wing mount right here looks like the uh looks like a little weak spot so we'll have to uh fix that uh, get a new mount for it but other than that I uh, can't wait to uh, give her another rip. All right, guys, until next time, Marcy Dude 81. Peace out.